Hello, Fotini Chandrika here from Horse Wisdom Yoga and Red Barn Wellness Farm in Ontario, Canada, enjoying this beautiful sunny day. I hope you're enjoying your time at the symposium. It's been filled with incredible presenters and speakers, and of course you, the participants who make this event all that it is, and our combined passion for the love of horses. So let's come into a comfortable seated position. If you have a yoga mat, that's great. It's certainly not necessary. You can sit on a blanket or on your carpet, um, removing the socks, preferably. And let's start by just placing the palms on the heart center. Just feeling into the center of your heart, the place where the horses know you best, the place where the horses live. And just centering yourself in a sense of gratitude. And anytime thoughts enter your mind, I know there's a lot of information circulating here today. Anytime the thoughts enter your mind or the information pops back in, simply take a deep breath and come back into your body, into the center of your heart. And perhaps there's a special horse there that's been guiding you here at the symposium today. Taking a moment to send gratitude to your special horse or horses that have sent you here. From here, we're gonna move into a seated twist to start to stimulate some circulation in the spinal cord, releasing that cerebral fluid that's so beneficial to our bodies, our brains, our organs. So bringing the right hand behind the back to lift the torso up nice and tall, we're gonna bring the left arm over to the right knee and look over the right shoulder. Good. From here, we're gonna switch sides, lifting that torso, Breathing into that stretch, looking over the left shoulder. And slowly coming back to center. At center, we're going to bring the left arm up to reach for the sky. And we're going to bend that elbow, reaching over with the right arm. Getting a nice little stretch here. From here, you can take the right arm and reach behind the back. Try to reach your fingers together. If that's not working today, please don't force. Just meet yourself where you are with honor and acceptance. Good. From here, lifting that left arm back up, releasing it beside the hip. Let's reach that right arm up towards the sky. Bending that elbow, reaching over with the left arm for a nice stretch here. From here, let's reach that left arm behind the back, meet yourself where you are. Reaching for those fingertips without force. Good and gently releasing both arms beside the hips. From here, let's bring the soles of the feet together and just flutter the knees like a butterfly, starting to remove some tension from the hips. Good. From here, we're gonna drop the chin towards the chest Feel the elongating of the spine and gently rolling the head and the neck towards the right shoulder. Deep inhale here. And as you exhale, lowering the chin back to the chest and inhale. Gently rolling to the left shoulder. Good. And coming back to neutral. 
From here, let's come onto hands and knees, starting with tabletop position. In tabletop, we're gonna move through cat and cow. So as you exhale, you're gonna draw the pelvis and draw the chin, everything coming in towards the chest. You can press the fingertips into the earth, really exaggerating that posture. And as you inhale, bringing the tailbone up towards the ceiling, shoulders away from the ears, navel drops down towards the earth. Good. We're gonna move through this to the rhythm of your breath. Exhale, folding everything in, inhale. Good. We'll do two more here. And coming back to your tabletop. From tabletop, let's lift that left arm up towards the ceiling. And exhale, draw that left arm under the right, bringing the left ear towards the earth. You can bring the right hand behind the back. Good, bringing the palms back to the earth and tabletop, let's do the other side now. Inhale the right arm up towards the sky. And exhale, bringing it under the left, right ear towards the mat, left arm comes behind the back. Good, coming back to your tabletop. From here, we're gonna curl the toes and we're gonna lift ourselves up into downward facing dog. In downward facing dog, you're gonna pedal the knees like you're riding a bike. Good. And when you're ready, you can lower the knees to the earth, bring the tailbone down towards your mat and come into child's pose. In child's pose, we're gonna walk the hands to the left side of the mat. and walking the hands over to the right side of the mat. And coming back to center. From here, we're slowly gonna bring ourselves up onto the knees into candlestick. And here in candlestick, we're gonna lower the left arm towards the earth. We're gonna bring that right arm up and over for a deep side stretch. Feel the breath filling your lungs, creating space in the rib cage. And you can look up if it feels comfortable for you, up to the right elbow. And you can look down at the left thumb Inhale, coming up, exhale, releasing that right arm towards the earth, left arm comes up and over, looking up at the left elbow, looking down at the right thumb. Inhale, coming up, exhale, release. Come back into your comfortable seated position where we began our practice. Placing the palms on your heart center Coming back to that place of extreme gratitude. Hi, Spirit. Gratitude for the special horse or horses that have guided you here today to the symposium. and opening your heart in connection and join up with all of the participants and all of their special horses. Wow. 
what an incredible group of beings we have here today. Wishing you all a fantastic remainder of the day today at the symposium and all the best to you and your horses.